16 years since Jennifer Kessie disappeared from Orlando. The Kessie family is still working with investigators to try to bring their daughter home. Fox 35's Randy Hildreth is joining us live this morning in Orlando. And Randy, there's just that one really key piece of evidence in this case. Yeah, good morning. That surveillance video has been a key part of this investigation. It showed an unidentified man park her car in this area off Downing Street and then leave. Now for Jennifer Kessie's family, the frustration is still fresh, the desperation to find her and a little bit of anger towards Orlando police. They posted an update on the GoFundMe page just a few days ago before today's anniversary. Uh, her family saying that they're still waiting on Orlando police to provide some records in her case. You may remember they settled a lawsuit back in 2019 over access to those files. Now, throughout the years, OPD has tweeted out images and pictures from that surveillance video. The family says they wanted to get those documents so their private investigator can continue the search. Her dad posting on that GoFundMe account saying, quote, we firmly believe the department's negligence and lack of competency cost Jennifer the chance to be found. So our team sits ready to show any law enforcement agency where to go, who to speak to, and what questions to ask. Now, Jennifer Kessie was 24 years old when she disappeared from her Orlando condo, essentially without a trace. The family says that they are focusing on the case files from the first three months after she disappeared. As you reach out to Orlando Police Department this morning to get the very latest on this investigation, as soon as I hear back, I will pass that information along. Live this morning in Orlando, Randy Hildreth, Fox 35 News.